Good evening, everybody. I'm Mr. Jutes, and I'm on to Abanet. Today, I'm going to show you how to set workspace environment in terms of investigation. 2G workspace for GSM drive, 3G workspace for WCDME drive, 4G workspace for LTE drive. Drive tests are uh, engineers are those who drive around checking out network to discover where telecommunication network is good or bad. If you want to know more about drive tests, you can check it out on Google. Drive test is a very good field in telecommunication industry that I would recommend you try out. The software that I'm going to teach with is Terms Investigation. And this is what Terms Investigation looks like. I'm using version 15.2.2. There are higher or lower and lower versions that are available, but they all have common features. Well, I'm going to teach what we have here are different uh, windows, window components within the uh, terms of investigation uh, GUI, which you, this is where you're going to set your workspace. And I'm going to start with 2G. So let me close every other stuff I have here. You can see this by default when you launch your terms investigation, or even if you don't see it, um, you can easily set your workspace the way you want. So you're going to go to a presentation. There's a particular window that is common to all the workspace if you're doing 2G, 3G, or 4G, and that is the map. You're going to bring out your map. When you click go to presentation, positioning, you click map. So your map is going to come out, and that's what I have here. And next to this is to bring out, to set uh, my 2G workspace. My two, for me to set my 2G workspace, when I come to presentation, I'm going to go to JSM. One important window is you bring out your serving plus neighbors. But this is where you'll be able to see um, the cell that is serving you when you're doing drive tests and other surrounding neighbors that are most likely going to get turned over from cell that is serving you, okay? Under GSM also, you can bring out your radio parameters where you're going to have uh, some information about your radio displayed, okay? Let me close this. And you're also going to bring out your GSM light chart. Well, actually, well, the two the two windows that are extremely important for you to bring out are the GSM serving plus neighbors and your map, where you can see yourself how you're moving and how you're not moving. This is not going to make the network better because you you have a very good workspace. No, but what the workspace does for you is for you to actually see what you are doing and you be able to monitor what you're doing. That doesn't mean that when you save your log file, exact the very file that's going to be processed to check network, it's going to be different. Whether the way you save your network workspace, it's not going to change what you're going to get. What your workspace will do for you is to see, for you to monitor what you're doing. So, having set this, I can easily come to a file, save workspace out, and then I will go to. I can save it on the um, desktop. Give it. 2G workspace. Okay, I have the workspace I've already said before. So I can replace this. Okay. I can replace this. Now let me do for 3G. Close what you have here. Then going back to the same location, the same play um, menu where you have presentation. You can go to WCDMA. Okay. Pick your serving plus neighbors. Then put it over here. Go back to a presentation. WCDMA, you can pick your um, WCDMA line chart. Okay. Like I said, these two windows, which is your map and your serving plus neighbor, are the most important windows you should not forget to bring up. Okay, so I'm going to save this. You can save this workspace. I repeat what I, I've done before as 3G. 3G workspace. Don't do save workspace because when you do save workspace, you're going to replace this 3G workspace with what you have 
we've said before that's on 2G workspace. So you can easily save 2G, 3G, 4G, whichever drive test you're doing, know what you can bring. You can still decide to say, okay, let me do for 4G. So you go to presentation, the same process, go to LTG, you pick your serving plus neighbor, set it over here, and every other information you need. What if I decide to say, okay, I'm doing 2G, 3G, 4G, all the same time. What can I do? I can decide to put WCDM because this is a possibility. I can put WCDM over here. Then pick, go to DSM, pick your serving plus neighbors, put it over here. And then um, go back to LTE. Then I can put serving plus neighbor. Then I'm going to save 2G, 3G, 4G workspace. In the same workspace, I'm going to have the three uh, technologies tested. Uh, one of the important stuff I want to tell you is most times when you're doing drive test, you have a phone you're using for 2G, a different phone for 3G, another phone for 4G. Depending on how you connected this phone, your MS1 is like mobile station 1 is the first phone you connect, MS2 is the second phone, MS3 is the third phone you connect, and so on and so forth. I want to show you how to connect your mobile phones, but for now I'm setting workspace. So, supposing, uh, assuming you did what I just told you now, the 3G is your, or uh, let's say 2G is your first phone, which is MS1. Second phone is MS2, which is 3G. How do you change this? Because if you don't change this, you're not going to see anything on 3G display. So, you're going to right click here, properties, then you come over here to change it to MS2. Okay? So, you're going to have MS2 here, MS1 here. Let us assume I want to change this to MS3. So I'm going to come here and um, repeat the same stuff. And I have different MS over here. And like I said, this is your map where you'll be seeing your cells, where you'll be monitoring your movement, and so on and so forth. Okay, that's it. Don't forget to save your workspace like I've advised before. Don't forget to save your workspace. Alright, that's it. Um, don't go to our websites, go to our social media links to follow us and you get updates on all the things we are posting. You can like us, you can follow us on Twitter at Abanet Solution. Take note of the S that is not here. Every other one has S. For other social media is just stroke Abanet Solutions. Okay? And do not forget to subscribe to my channel on you, my YouTube channel for more videos. And do not forget to also share our videos to your friends and your colleagues. Thank you. Bye-bye.